Hey there YouTube, this is here to learn 442. I'm going to the range tomorrow and I'm going to shoot off some partially full boxes of 44 Magnum that I have sitting around. And I thought, you know, some of this is not going to be around tomorrow, so I might want to show it off to some people on YouTube today. Um, one particular YouTuber comes to mind, STL Ammo Man, so if you're watching this, um, I hope you enjoy. Um, I'm going to go the spectrum here as to what I have from lightweight to heavy. Um, the lightweight end of the spectrum for 44 Magnum is like this PMC bronze here, which is in a reloadable case, a reloadable brass case. But this is a 180 grain jacketed soft or jacketed hollow point. Uh, 180 grains is a lightweight bullet for the 44 Magnum, and that bullet should be fast in that loading. Moving on, we have a 240 grain semi-jacketed soft point. All right, 240 grains is the standard weight for uh, standard loadings in 44 Magnum. Um, you know, that's what you'll normally find uh, when you go and ask for some 44 Magnum at the gun store or uh, your sporting goods store. Over here, we have some factory reloaded 240 grain lead cast wad cutter in a brass reloadable case moving on we have some blazer this is a 240 grain semi jacketed hollow point but this is not blazer brass this is blazer aluminum that's an aluminum case and uh, it is not advised to reload aluminum cases do so at your own risk this is american eagle this is also 240 grain this is a jacketed hollow point in brass reloadable case. Winchester white box, 240 grain, semi-jacketed soft point. Probably going to be using some of this when I go hunting for a uh, wild pig, otherwise known as boar, later on this year. And then, of course, we can't forget the Hornady, the big boy, the 300 grain XTP from Hornady fully jacketed hollow point and I believe that this is a bonded bullet so uh, it'll retain most of that 300 grain weight upon expansion anyway that's uh, kind of the range of normal factory loads for 44 Magnum they started around 180 grains they go up to about 300 grains um, there are some lighter loadings that are made. There are some heavier loadings that are made. Um, but this is kind of the average range. So I uh, hope that you found this video to be informative. Um, as always, keep learning, share your knowledge. Thanks for watching, everyone.